Hey Vale Valley Live, this is Madison, your behind the scenes girl. Um, I am going to take you guys on a hike of the week and we're going to start right here at Gondola One, right in Vale Village. Um, it's called Strawberry Lane, it's only about 2.7 miles only about 700 feet of elevation gain. So it should be a pretty quick, pretty easy little hike that you can absolutely do with your friends and family when they come to visit you. All right, let's get hiking. This is always so crazy to me. We're literally on the ski runs right now. So just because there's no snow does not mean that the season is over. It is hiking season. It is biking season. It is get outside season. So seriously, go get your feet dirty. This is awesome. All right, we are only about a half mile in. And guys, let me tell you, there is some serious incline. So if you are visiting and you're, or if you're new to hiking, welcome, happy to have you here. A few things to keep in mind when you're hiking on vacation or somewhere at high altitude, it does get harder to breathe. So just make sure that you are listening to your body and making sure that you are going at a pace that's comfortable for you. The last thing that you want is to overexhaust yourself and not be safe while you're out here. Something that is also very, very real out here are bears. They are out and they are excited to be around. So fun fact, right? As we're talking about animal safety on trails, I am hiking up in front of my new friend here say hi <laughs> and I hear a noise thinking it's a mountain biker because there's lots of mountain bikers up here and we got to share the trails and there is a big old moose about 15 feet in front of me and it is just staring at me but as my new friend also knows make it very clear that you are not a threat and so you slowly start to walk away and let it move on so we let it pass and we waited a little bit and we're out here trying it again all right <laughs> all right i am up here at the end of uh strawberry lane well i'm taking a little break here thought that we could talk a little more about some mountain safety stuff as i said we did see a moose this is their home we are visitors in their home and as much as this is our backyard this is their place so we want to be really respectful and really cautious um things to keep on you at all times are um, a can of bear spray is a big one and then also if you're hiking alone a really good thing to have with you is something that makes noise those are just some a couple things that you can do to really be careful out here especially if you're new to the area i know it's exciting don't run up and touch the animals don't talk to them let them do their thing let them be all right so i am up here at the end of strawberry lane where it turns into berry picker so you can also take berry picker down here to Lion's Head or you can go back to Vail Village the same way that you came. Um, so far we have made some new friends, we have seen some animals, and we've seen quite a few mountain bikers. Something else I wanted to mention about hiking around up here is we really want to leave the trail better than we found it. And if you see trash, go ahead and pick it up. I always have a bag in my backpack to grab things on the way out. Another safety thing that I want to talk about is just to remind you all, always let someone know where you are. As a solo hiker, and especially as a female solo hiker, I always text somebody and tell them where I'm going. All right, we just finished up. That was about 2.7 miles. Um, took a little over an hour. Um, but now let's head into the village and grab a drink real quick. And now it's the best part of the hike, the apres. Apres is all season long, guys. It is not just ski season. So I'm about to head into one of my favorite spots, Big Bear Cafe, and grab a little drink and a little snack, and then head home. All right, guys, I'll see you next week.